Learn how to make simple composites in Photoshop using the Layer Mask tool so that you guys can take your photos to the next level. What is up guys, welcome back to The Raw Factory. My name is Jacob and the goal of this channel is to help you become a better food and product photographer. To help you guys understand how a layer mask works, I'm going to show you a quick example. Take a look at this orange image. If I make a new layer and call it blue, then make a selection and click the mask icon, Photoshop makes a new black and white layer beside it. Notice that what is shown as black is hidden and what is shown as white is what we can actually see. Pretty cool, right? But check this out. If I grab the brush tool and select black as my color and now paint in with black, you can see it hides more of the blue. And if I paint in with white, it does the opposite. Guys, are you getting this? Are you getting this? Well, that was too close. Too close, man. Now that you guys know how to use the layer mask tool in Photoshop, I'm gonna show you guys a real life example. Take a look at this drink shot. I have inserted both images into Photoshop, one with the lemon sitting perfectly at the top and the other has the liquid in it, which has made everything sink. So I wanna merge these images to make the perfect shot. And thankfully, I know how to use the layer mask tool. Now I'm gonna use the pen tool to make a selection around the area I want to mask in. Double click the layer mask to give it a name. Command click the layer mask to create a selection. Head back over to the layer and now click the layer mask icon. Bam, bam, just like that. Not bad, good job. No, no, not this again. <laughs> now to make it look a little more natural and not so hard edged, I grab the brush tool and decrease the hardness and brush away the black when I want to remove some of the pixels or brush in with white when I want to bring some of the pixels back into the image. Now, if I turn off the top layer on and off, what do you guys think? Pretty girl, right? Now, before you think about leaving, thinking that you know it all and you got it all down pat, pause. Wait a second. Let me show you this little keyboard shortcut that's going to be a bit of a game changer. If you select the layer mask and you click this key on your keyboard, it will show you in red what is hidden. As you can see, there are pixels on the outside of the glass that don't really need to be shown from the top layer. So I'm going to paint in with black. And as you can see, as I paint in with black, it shows that area as red, meaning it is hidden. And now to turn off this super helpful guide, all you have to do is re-click that exact same button. What can I say? It is just, this has been a good session. You guys, uh, I can't wait to see what you guys make. I mean, <laughs> damn, that truck is loud, man. That truck is loud. Okay, well, that is all for me today, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you got something out of it. If you did, like, comment, subscribe to help others find this video. And <laughs> I will see you all in the next one. Remember, guys, don't wait. Make something creative today. Catches.